In this demonstration, we'll start with setting the motion area. With the Vid Center application open and connected to a unit, select the Set Up DVRs option in the Task Center. Next, expand the list under Task Actions to show the NVR properties. Double click on Motion Setup to display the Motion Setup dialog box. In the top bar, notice the Camera drop down box, Quality and Request Video Options. Select the camera for which motion needs to be set. If the quality setting is configurable, select an option that serves best for viewing the live video in the motion setup window. It is important to understand, this quality setting will in no way affect the recording of video on the NVR. It is only used to adjust the display of the live video while configuring the motion areas. Once the camera is selected, click on Request Video. Live video from that camera will then be displayed within the status window. In the status window, the default will show the grid and an orange overlay on top of the live video as seen here. There are two key considerations to make note of in this instance. First, as a default, the entire field of view is highlighted to detect motion. Second, as motion occurs within the motion detection area, the motion area turns green. Moving forward, keep these considerations in mind. Below the status window are the configuration changes. However, as mentioned earlier, if a megapixel camera is the first camera in the list, motion windows will be displayed. In the review of analog camera number one, the configuration settings consist of sensitivity, show grid, clear all, and select all. Sensitivity represents an adjustment on how much activity has to occur within the motion area before motion is triggered. Show grid, as seen here, will remove the grid from the status window. The clear all and select all options simply set motion area accordingly. We'll select Clear All at this point. Notice the status window no longer blinks green when motion occurs anywhere within the field of view. In the status window, click and drag the left mouse button and the orange overlay will be displayed. If the user overshoots in painting a motion area, simply right-click on the mouse to deselect the area. Again, to adjust sensitivity, simply click up or down while watching to ensure detection of the appropriate objects within the motion area. In this example, a person entering the highlighted area triggers the motion and changes the area to green. Now, click Close, at which point VidCenter will ask if you want to save the changes. Select Yes.